7, verse 7, uh, Proverbs 14 and 26, uh, Proverbs 14 and 27, and Proverbs 15 and 16. Okay? You ready? Are y'all ready to read the Word of God? Amen. Are y'all ready to read the Word of God? Amen. Amen. Let's read the Word of God. It says, the, the fear, fear of the Lord is, is the beginning, beginning of knowledge, knowledge and fools despise, despise wisdom, wisdom and, and instruction. And instruction. Proverbs 14 and 26. It says, in the, the fear, fear of the Lord, Lord there is strong confidence, confidence and, and his, his children will have, have a place of refuge. refuge. Proverbs 14 and 27. The fear, the fear of the Lord, Lord is a fountain, fountain of life to turn, to turn one away, away from the, the snares of death. death. Proverbs 15 and 16. Better is, is little with the fear of the Lord than great treasure with trouble. trouble. Amen? Amen. Amen. You may be seated. Now, Father, we just thank you right now. Yes. We thank God. you for your word, God. And that, God, that you're developing in us, God, the fear of the Lord. God, that, that not that we're walking around scared of God. Yes, but we're walking Lord. around with a sense of respect, a sense of reverence, a sense of awe. That you are God Almighty and you're God by yourself. Yes, that, Lord. That, God, we are nothing but you are everything. That's and right. only in you can we live and breathe and have our being. Yes. So, God, we surrender ourselves right now. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Holy Spirit, we welcome you. Yes, Lord. To open our eyes that we might see you. Yes. At a fresh and in a real way. That's right. God, we bind every demonic force that would hinder us yes, from oh seeing God. you in a real way. We bind spirits of deception. Yes, God, we Lord. bind spirits of fear and doubt and unbelief. Yes. And we release faith in this place right now yes, to Lord. receive yes. all that you have for us. Yes. In Jesus' name. 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 Amen and amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Just to review real quickly and recapitulate. We want to deal with what the fear of the Lord is. And we can go to the next slide. The fear of the Lord. It's simply the fear of the Lord is a deep-seated reverence for God that causes men and women to want to please him at all costs. Genuine fear of the Lord is always seen in obedience to the word of God. You can't tell me that you fear the Lord, but yet you don't obey his word. Yes. Amen? Amen. The Bible says, forsake not the assembling of ourselves together as such is. As the day approaches in Hebrews chapter 10, verse 26. Guess what? That means that we should be coming together when it's time to come together. Amen? Yes, yes. The Bible yes. says men shall always pray and not faint. You can't tell me that you love God and you don't have a prayer life. Yes. Are y'all with me? Amen. Because who you love, you talk to. That's right. Are you with me? Now, how could I, how I look say, oh, this woman is fine, but she is. It's my wife. I'm talking about my wife. Amen? And looking pretty today. Honey, you do look pretty today. Amen? <laughs> And so, but yet, I never talk to him when I'm at home. Hmm. What would that make me? Hypocrite. Right? A hypocrite. Yes. An actor. Amen? I'll be acting one way on stage and another way at home. But honey, I tell you I love you at home. Yes. Do I tell you you look fine at home? Yes. I'll be chasing around the house. Are y'all with me? <laughs> Are y'all with Amen. me? Amen. So it's a consistency there. So I'm not just giving her compliments when we get on the stage and then we're at home. I'm like, man, what you do? Get out of my face. Are y'all with me? Right. Amen. I'm loving her. Yes. Amen. And some of us do God that way. Yeah, we love him. We, oh, praise the Lord. Oh, baby. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Get out of here. Get in the parking lot. Why they move in front of me? Who they think they are? They ain't been here long. Yes. You think because you, you got a new car? You, are y'all with me? Come on. It's the wrong attitude. Or just, you know, you get on the highway. You had a glorious day, and then you let somebody on the highway throw your whole day off. Are you on the, are you on the um, I don't know about you, but I've learned to do is when I'm on the highway, just give the person grace. Mm -hmm. I know what I'm talking about. How many ever had a, I came out of a great prayer time, out of the morning prayer, and you get ready to get on the highway, somebody cut in front of you. Yeah. And they act like they don't see you. Yeah. You know, they saw yeah. you, you never seen that, or you ever go to the store, and they, and they know you're about to turn in the parking space. Has that happened to y'all? Come on, yes, yes. And a person yes. turned the parking space, and then they don't look at you. Yes. You know what I'm talking about? Yes, yes, They don't look at you, they don't, they, is it just me? No. And you, you give them the stare, you know how many know what the stare is. You give them the stare to look at like you know, like you know what you did, you know, and they get out the car, and they walk like they don't even see you. Yes, yes, yes. 
Good. What you got to say? God bless it. You bless it, son of God. Are y'all with me? Amen. You got to go ahead and release them. Amen? Amen. Maybe they were having a bad day. Or maybe they just played me. But I ain't going to let you spoil my day. Are y'all with me? Yeah. Why am I going to let somebody that I don't even know mess up my whole day? <laughs> Have you ever thought about that? Amen. Move you out of the will of God. Amen. The genuine fear of the Lord is always seen in obedience to the word of God. Proverbs 8 and 13 says the fear of the Lord is to hate evil, pride, and arrogancy, and the evil way, and the forward mouth do I hate. See, I believe when you have the fear of God, you don't let everything come out your mouth. Are you with me? Amen. Because you understand God is watching you. You understand? How do you read that next one, Oswald Chambers? Oswald Chambers once stated, the remarkable thing about fearing God is that when you fear God, you fear nothing else, whereas if you do not fear God, you fear everything else. Amen? So, so you get over what people say. See, here's the thing. People that don't believe that I'm shy. At times. They, I tell them I'm a shy person. They don't believe that, but they don't understand that when the Spirit of God came on me, I had to move out of myself. Yes. In myself, I don't like public speaking. But in God, I'm called to speak publicly. Yes, yes. Are y'all with Come me? On. And, 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 and in God, I'm called to say what thus saith the Lord. And so I'm one of those people that will be sitting down and be like, why don't somebody say this? And the Holy Spirit says, why don't you say it? Yes. Are you with me? Yes. So I've learned to understand that my fear of people cannot be greater than my fear of a living God because I'm going to have to answer to him for what I did or did not do. Yes. Amen? Amen. And so that when I know that, when I understand that hell is real and heaven is real, and then I'm going to have to come before the white throne of judgment, and I'm going to see my whole life, and I'm going to have to answer to him for what I said and what I did and what I did not do, then i got to speak. Yes, yes, yes. I'm not scared of what you think because I'm looking at the Father. I'm focused on the Father. If you're more scared of what people think about you, then you're focusing on the wrong thing. Let me say that again. If you're scared, more scared of what people think about you, then you're focused on the wrong thing. You have something called the fear of people. Yes, and we're talking yes. about the fear of the Lord. Yes, Are you with yes, me? That's yes. what I was talking about today when I was in the earlier session with the leadership team. Is this that I don't want my children. I see, I, I see these reality shows with the different Christian reality shows that people are trying to come out now. And what bothers me the most is I hear the different preachers telling their kids, you know what? You can't do that in front of the church folk. You can't do that when you're around people in the church. They may think this about us. Yes, yes. And what that communicates to uh, a, a young mind is that there's duality, that there's a double standard. You act one way around church folk, and you act one way when you're at home. Yes. That's not, that's not Christianity. That's not Christianity in spirit form. Christianity in spirit form is you act one way unto God. Yes. Did you hear yes, me, church? Yes. Amen? So I don't cuss, not just when I'm with church folk, I don't cuss when I get home. Yes. Amen, light bulb. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory yes. to God. Amen, light bulb. Yes. Hey, Come on. Let me tell you something. If you're a person that cuss, just go ahead and cuss while you're here. You're looking at me crazy. God, is God here? Yes, he is. Is God with you when, he go, when you go home? Yes, he is. So the only thing that's making you forget that he's at home with you is because somewhere you've locked God in to make you think that he's not with you at home. Yes, yes, yes. Are y'all with me? And in other words, go, go ahead. the reverence or fear of God, because in the beginning it says right here to simply put it, the fear of God is the deep-seated reverence for God that causes men to want to please him. So to reverence God, you've got to revere him. Revere simply means just acknowledge him. So if you're not acknowledging him in your personal time, even as you're also highlighting in the leadership time, it starts just when you're alone. If you don't have any sense of pursuit in that fresh five, in that prayer time, in praising God, whether you feel like it or not, it's not based off of feeling. It's based off giving yourself over to the Lord in faith. And then as you do that, God begins to reveal himself and you can't fear somebody you don't know. That's so you right. have to spend time with the Lord in order to discover who he is that you should be revering or fearing. Amen? Say that again because you went in and out. Okay. You know, for the so people you on the video. Fear someone no, that not loud or hold it, please. Okay. You cannot fear somebody that you don't know. So you have to spend time with the Lord so that you can get to know him. And as you get to know him, that revelation knowledge of who he is will begin to allow you to fear him. 
And like you say, that fear is not a, ooh, I'm fearful that, you know, I don't want to be struck if I say something wrong, you know. It's more so he's so, revere also means to be in awe of him. He's so great. He's so awesome. He's so faithful. You're discovering those traits when you're in that personal prayer time with the Lord so that you don't want to disappoint him you, out of love. And so yeah. that's the type and, of fear that we're talking about. And the other thing is, is dealing with your thought life. Yes. See, don't wait till it gets to your mouth. When it gets to your mouth, it's too late. Yeah. Deal with those thought life when somebody gets to your mind. How many of you can cuss somebody, out, cuss somebody out in your mind? That's true. You know, and so what happened, and so you know on your job that you're not supposed to do that. Mm -hmm. But so, you, some of you laugh at me when I, when I saw some of your faces, you were looking at me, and so I said, you blessed son of God. You're like, you really don't do that. Ask my kids if I do that. I say it out loud, so my mind won't go. I have to control my mind and reprogram it so it won't do what the, what the devil is telling me to do. Yes, come on. Are y'all with me? Come on, yes. Because my flesh doesn't want to say blessed son of God. You're right. So I have to say, flesh, you're not in control. This is a blessed son of God. If it's a, if it's a woman, it's a blessed daughter of God. Amen? Yes, come on. It's part of God's creation that God has allowed to come in my life to perfect the Christ on the inside of me. Yes, come on. Am I, am I making sense? Yes. 